morning. Oh. Hey. 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 I thought you'd give up maybe and come to bed. Oh. I wanted to. I thought about you all night. I honestly, I don't think Brandon's gonna come crashing through this door. Look, I'm gonna make sure that he never hurts you again. Hey. Well, you don't have to wait on me. It's my apartment. I get to do what I want. Uh, how'd you sleep? I almost came out on the sofa, just so I could keep you company. Oh, it's better that you didn't. You would have been a major distraction. <laughs> I'm sure I got more sleep than you. Maybe because I knew you were out here. You don't want me to stay here? I mean, not in a chair in front of my door. You can't guard me 24-7. So that's why I am going through with my decision to drop the charges against Brandon. Abby, he, he put you in the hospital. He tried to rape you. No, he has to pay for that. Not if you have to get on the witness stand. Look, they're bluffing. They have no evidence against me. Look, your brother could lose his badge. If they convince a judge that you attacked him first and Dante tried to cover it... I went after Brandon because he was trying to rape you. Look, if I drop the charges, Brandon, well, he, he will take his freedom and he'll leave Port Charles. He came after you before. Who's to say he won't try it again? Look, Believe by me. now he knows who you are, Michael. He knows who your father is. He is not going to want to mess around with Sonny Corinthos. Okay, then you won't try anything at the trial. Okay, that's different. You are a paroled felon. I mean, how hard could it be for his lawyer to make you look terrible? I mean, maybe even get you sent back to Pentonville on a violation. So you're just going to drop the charges? No. No. Look, I'm not going to let the guy who abused you walk free. I will not let that happen. If you give in, Brandon will know you're vulnerable. He'll use that against you as long as he can. I'm afraid a trial is going to hurt you. Look, it's not your job to protect me. I can handle Brandon. You know, it really scares me when you talk like that. <sighs> Look, I'm sorry. I don't, I don't, I'm not trying to scare you. It's the last thing I want to do. Look, why don't we just deal with this after the memorial, okay? We're going to be late. I want to drop the charges now. Today. Instead of going to the memorial? I made my decision. I won't let you risk going back to jail. Oh, check with the ADA, see if you can get a restraining order. I don't want a restraining order. I want Brandon out of our lives. Look, Abby, Brandon is a bully and a rapist. Look, if you give in, he'll take that as permission to hurt you any time and any way he wants. But you need to stand up to him. If you don't, I will. Hey, how was the service? Uh... Incredibly sad. Jason didn't show up. It was just, uh... I was sitting with my mom and Jax. Steve Weber gave the eulogy. Lucky was a wreck. Oh, God, I can't imagine losing a child. Jason gave up Jake to keep him safe. So he wouldn't turn out like me. Michael. That's not true. You know, when I was a kid, my, my mom and Jason and my dad, they thought if they loved me enough, they could keep me safe and protected. And it didn't work. And they didn't want that for Jake. So he gave up being a father to protect them, and he died in a traffic accident. So what does that tell you? Glad I'm alive. Yes. And make your life count for something, Michael. You know, you, uh, you've shown me that I can have somewhat of a normal life. And I can be in love. But I, I can't change who I am. That's fine. I would never want to change who you are. <laughs> Um, how to go with the ADA? Ah, uh, well, Brandon's lawyer won't even consider a plea bargain. I guess she's gonna call you in as a hostile witness and enter your manslaughter conviction as evidence. 
So she's threatening me so that you will drop the charges. It worked. How is this different from all the nights the neighbors called because Brandon was beating you and you never pressed charges? Look, Brandon isn't worth the risk that you could go back to prison. If you're on parole, you're vulnerable. I don't need to be protected. The system is supposed to protect you, but it can't if you drop the charges. Michael, I, I am just asking you to respect me. I made this decision based on what matters to me. I don't want a trial. I don't want the ugliness. I just want to be with you. I would do whatever it takes to protect you. I mean it. 